Hey guys, what's happening? So, I thought I'd show you my 1 8 scale, 1 10 scale wheel adapters for a uh, Serpent, uh, Pico, or a couple other companies made these, but it's a 1 10 scale, 235 millimeter width. Um, they made these in like uh, the late 90s, early 2000s. And uh, I think they were actually the best 10 scale ever made, you know? It was like a scaled down version of the 1 8 scale um, with the quick release tires and everything, but problem is, I have another one here, another circuit impact, um, is you can no longer find these tires. These tires are like impossible to find. Um, they don't make them anymore, so, I mean, if you're going to continue to use these tires, and you need to probably get new donuts and, and glue them yourself, but, um, so I finally decided to take the, uh, the plunge and take a risk and try to figure out a way to adapt these tires. So this, these are 8 scale tires on a 10 scale car. Uh, but before I show you the adapters, I'll show you the, the difference, how they look. So, so yeah, the tires are definitely bigger. The fronts are almost exactly the same. So there's, there's hardly any difference in the front, but the backs are wider and thicker. I have a couple here I'll show you here. Here's your traditional 235, and this might be a little bit worn out too. So the, the, the hubs are not that much of a difference in size, but there's more foam. So this will eventually wear down, um, but the internal diameter is bigger. So that's actually why I need to create these hub adapters right here. So, alright. So, Part of the hub adapter is there's, there's two different parts. It's on my thing first page down below. All right. So this is the rear adapter and the little notch. I actually created two channels in case one gets worn out and you can flip it around. Um, and obviously that lines up with that. I made them actually kind of tight because you want these things to be as tight as possible. And it just slides on like that. And then you just pop the tire or this thing in the back of the tire. And there's four tines or like locks right here and that just snap into place like that and you just push down and it will snap into place and then because the tire is actually longer the, the hub in the rear is longer and in the front I created these extended locks so you just got to replace your lock with this one and it extends it out to a lock like that so cool no more ugly yellow tires and this thing's obviously going to have a lot more traction with the bigger tires and uh, because they're, they're actually going to have higher top end speed too because the tires are uh, larger in diameter. Um, cool. So yeah, if you have one of these cars, you know, I mean, this will definitely, uh, you know, if you don't want to destroy the remaining stock that you have. I, I have a lot of these tires, by the way, these older style tires, but still, I mean, it's a nightmare headache to refoam these things. But uh, cool. That's, that's it. Got the fronts too. All right on my Thingiverse page. Cool.